This is Jeff Guy with MMA KO, and I'm standing next to my main man, Mike, with Beat Down Fight Gear, the man that's making it all happen with the clothing. First off, man, how are you? Hanging in there, brother. Hanging in there. Now, talk to us about this company. I mean, we've seen it. You guys are going big. You've been doing it a long time. Walk us through how the start of this company did. Uh, 2008, I think it was my first fight and uh, sold more shirts than I got paid to fight. Wow. <laughs> so I kind of hmm, get punched in the face or sell a t-shirt. Plus, it's fun. Sounds like selling shirts. Yeah. Or uh, doing interviews. Right, yeah, it's fun. You don't got to get punched. <laughs> yeah, no, it just, it was always, uh, I've always just loved making shirts and selling them. And, and then when that happened, I saw uh, potential for more money than fighting. So I was, well, why not sell some shirts? Now, you got into the clothing. What was the first comp? Well, actually, what was the first promotion where you really kind of got your first break? Um, you know, Uriah Faber's, uh, what was his called, his promotion called? Uh, I'm sorry, I forget his promotion, but Tabriz. Uh, he uh, hooked me up there at a booth, and I made pretty decent money. So I said, I'm going to try it a little bit bigger. And then Dave Huckaba, a good friend of mine, uh, he had his uh, dog of war. And then I really killed it there, and that's when I knew it was on. And uh, Man, that's huge. Yeah. I mean, it's huge. And you've been doing this a long time, and a lot of people, I've seen it. I've been to the shows. I've seen the lines where people want to buy. But let's talk about the one shirt that was the hottest selling shirt. It was I Run Sack. That was the big one, and tell me about that. And, and how'd you think of that one? Uh, that was Dave Huckova. We always talk. He's never, ever lost a title fight in Sacramento. And we're, we wanted to be cocky, but funny more than, you know, we don't want to be assholes. So it was stupid funny to me. So I said, Dave, we got to do a limited edition. I run sack. And, you know, Dave, he don't give a shit. He's like, whatever you say, brother, put it on there. And uh, people were offering eighty hundred dollars for a shirt and we just didn't have any more. You ran out so fast that you had to do a second edition of those shirts. But not with the I run sack. We left it. So those people who got them, they're the only ones who will ever have them. The limited edition of yeah. I Run Sack, probably yeah. my favorite shirt. I tried to get one. It was already too late. I didn't get you one? I, I couldn't get one. Yeah. But, you know, I don't know. I, I, I've never done that to you or anything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Murdering. <laughs> oh, my God. There we go. Well, would you like to do any final thoughts, final things to all the people that support you, your company, the fighters that you sponsor? Who would you like to thank? Uh, of course, Tim McKenzie, who just interviewed, good buddy of mine. Uh, Dave Huckaba always has my back. Love that guy to death. And uh, we're going to actually try and help out Nick uh, for his fight, too. He's a really good, uh, nice kid. He doesn't, he's not, you know, he's not a dick. He's a real legitimate athlete, too. So we're going to try and do something with him. And uh, maybe I'll fight again if you can get me a fight with Cal Worsham. I think we could try to make that. Uh, Cal, if you're listening, Right here, he's ready to make it happen. Like that. I won't even punch him. I'll slap him. <laughs> there you go. Now, if people can't make it to the shows and they still want to buy your gear, how do they do that? Oh, that's a bad question because my, my website is hacked right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's to go somewhere into China. But uh, there's a Beatdown MMA uh, Facebook page, but the uh, actual rockthisgear.com is my website, but it's hacked. So. Well, get them on Facebook. That's how they can find you. I'm gonna try, yeah, and I'm gonna try to go to Nick's uh, global knockout fight and set a booth up out there and do what I do. Well, you know how Mike does it. He is gonna bring the beat down every time. You gotta get this clothes, get them on you, wear it, and start beating people down. That's how it's done at Beat Down Fight Gear.